batar, bir bilmem ne olur ya oluyor ya. <gülüyor> oluyor oluyor öyle şey yani. şeyler. O Doğru. Yani bize Çok size sağ yardımcı olmak katkıda yani bu doğal kaynak, bu doğal kaynağın efendim işte korunması, geliştirilmesi, Tabii. ondan sonra iyileştirilmesi. Ya bir de şeye, e, ben sizin isminizi alıyorum. Yes, yes, yes, yes. Okay, wait, wait, wait, here. Here, say it here. Okay. So, so now while... That's okay. That's okay. Get in there. So now... Yeah, Ismail, Ersoy. So now while we are doing uh, wetland restoration with Sean Anderson, we have a visitor who is the director of the local Ministry of Environment Forestry, uh, Ismail Ersoy, and he would like to get information about what we are doing and why are we equipped like this, we dress like this. <laughs> and, and yeah, he says it's çok güzel, which means it's really nice. Güzel, değil mi? Yeah. He liked it so much. He liked our uh, 2001 conservation uh, costumes. <laughs> Arazi kıyafetim de aynısıdır. Aracımda çizmelerim mm -hmm. vesaire ama bugün biraz böyleyim. Evet. Ben bir misafirliğe gidecektim. Yeah, Hiç öyle oldu yani. Says, ama gidemedim. Doğru buraya geldim. <gülüyor> Bak, bu kıyafet. He yani. says usually when he does field work he has evet. something similar to this like camouflage clothes. But today he was going to visit somewhere then he cancelled on the way back. He decided to stop here and. The field is always more fun than. Yeah, I know. Yeah, şey diyor. Arazi her zaman bir yere bir eve gidip ziyaretten daha ya. Arazi hep. Çok. Yeah. Gayet tabii, gayet tabii. Yani zorunlu ziyaretti bizim buraya da gelişimiz ama sizinle de karşılaşmamız çok memnun oldum, çok mutlu oldum. Yani ben bu arazi çalışmalarını çok severim. Şimdi bu Kuyucuk Gölü Çevre Orman İl Müdürlüğü'nün sorumluluğunda olan bir yer. Yalnız yeni yapılanmaya göre tabii bakanlığımızda yeni bölge müdürlükleri vesaire hepsi yenmiş yani. Yenmiş. Tam da onunla ilgili aslında ha. yaptığımız ha. çalışma. Ha. Ha. Yenmiş. Aslında yenmemesi lazım. Hı -hı. Nemli, e, de korunması lazım. Buranın bu sene 8 kilometrelik dikenli tel ihata şeyini verdik yaptık biz. Ama şey, koyduk ancak ha, uygulanamadı henüz. Tabii uygul Ama şey Neden? zaten işte Çünkü çığ... Ramsar alanının biz tamamen dikenli tel ihatasıyla çevirmek istiyoruz. Evet. Ramsar alanı. Evet. Gönül gölün kendi alanı değil de Ramsar alanı evet. bu da 416 yani hektar civarında. Önemli. Fakat bu Ramsar alanı genellikle kültür arazilerinde Sorry why he was there. On... Sure. Yeah, sure. Okay. So the You can talk loud. Yeah, okay. Okay. So the director of the ministry visited us today while we were doing the field work of wetlands uh, restoration with Sean. And then the, uh, he, he said that he visited us because he wondered what we were doing. But actually, he sounded like that, like we do things without getting permission or Like we don't let them know step by step what we are doing there, and then of course as a volunteer, <laughs> I know what to say and I acted like a volunteer and knowing some and knowing don't know some, and then we just like changing the subject while he was asking, and some topics were, which were really strange. He was like talking about grazing that people have a right and blah blah. And on the other side, in the in the Ramsar site. Yeah, in the Ramsar site. Yeah, exactly. And I said, isn't this a protected area? So why don't you show them another place? And he was like, oh, they have a right, blah blah. You know, it, it was obvious that he really doesn't know exactly what what was going on or what is Ramsar, what is conservation, and all those things. And he was like saying something like about not sharing data or so and he sounded like that and he said yeah I understand it's really good that he was, saying, he was implying that we weren't sharing data with yeah him. yeah and I of course <laughs> in a polite way I told him that this is a Ramsar site and after 1998 this is the first Ramsar site that was named you know And this is with Kuzeyda's work, with John and his team's work. And then I said, this is because they share data and they use it really well and in a useful way. 
and of course, you know, they share together. And I told, you know, because they they are always proud when they when they go to some meetings anywhere else. They are proud about, oh, we have this much bird species, this much migratory, or this much wintering, you know. And I say, where do you get the numbers from? This team is working here. <laughs> Ask the volunteers, we are coming here. We are willing to come and learn something, help, you know, to do something for conservation, you know. Especially to support Kuzeda's work. And then he was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, he was not naming it, and he was general, generalizing things. And I was like, giving examples, and he was like, oh, no, no, blah, blah. I was like, yeah, I mean, in general, in Turkey, you know, I did the same <laughs> thing. Yeah, of course. And, and, and yeah, because, you know, I've been in this field, and I've been dealing with these kind of uh, officers many times, so we, we learn. Each day we learn new things, you know, how to deal with their questions, with their, you know, uh, maybe pressure, I would say, you know, instead of like helping us or supporting us in many ways. Not, I, I don't mean all of them, for instance, sure, sure, yeah, sure, sure. yeah, you know that. So, and on the other hand, we all, he talked with all the volunteers, three more were with me, with Sean, and then we, one of them was uh, forced and yeah, yeah. We, we were from different, you know. Uh, no, what, what was I gonna say? I'm <laughs> sorry. <laughs> okay. Okay. Anyway, so we were coming from different parts of the country, and he was really like, you know, shocked, and he was like, he couldn't believe, you know. And I was telling, and also the other volunteers were telling like. Oh, we are willing. This is a great, you know, chance to be here, to learn this, you know, to be part of it, you know. And then, uh, of course, we were like saying, "Oh, you're really lucky in cars, you know, because Kuzeda was here, Chan and his team doing great work, you know. Most of them are the first for Turkey, you know, and you should like take care of it and you know support more." And then he started to talk about that they support and they have a real budget for conservation, for this kind of work. And I said, well, being us here also costs a lot to Kuzedoa, and they try to, you know, find this. It's not as it seems, it's not easy just, you know, take your boots and walk in the mud. It's not like that. So he said, oh, I would do anything, just give me a call. This is, you know, they don't tell us, and, you know, he started to... <laughs> Well, that's good. So that means that when we call them, they will give us money and say help support yeah. us. That's great. Hey, wow. That totally happen. That's great. Yeah, you, you think so. <laughs> yeah. And he also invited... I'm positive for the students here. I, I'm, I'm saying, yeah. of course it might happen. Yeah. Sure, totally could maybe almost sometime, maybe ever sometime, maybe happen. Yeah. We need to push for that. <laughs> Probably he's gonna call because he got our numbers and he was curious about our work and you know coming all the way to cars you know uh, he really stepped back and he thought about this he's like all this beer because I came from the southwest part of the country to the northeast part of it and he's like oh wait a minute you know I'm sure he's thinking about what we talked about you know cool. so yeah well, that's good. Another conservation victory. Yeah. <laughs>